Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Eno. In today's video, we'll look at how we can turn a Linux Mint machine into a web server, which allows us to serve web pages and also to share files. Now we'll be using Apache. Now the first thing to do is to check the status of the Apache services. We can do system CTL status Apache 2. And in our case, we see that it's active, running, and enabled. If it wasn't active or if it wasn't installed, there is one quick command you can run to install Apache 2. It's a sudo apt install Apache 2. And to enable services, you can do systemctl enable Apache and to start services just change this to start Apache 2. Now that we verify that Apache is running we can open a browser and see if we can access that web page so there should be a default web page let's open a browser and see if we can access it now since it's on this local machine we can just oh, we can do 127.0.0 0.0.0.1 so for mine i've modified it it's saying welcome Eno. for mine i've modified it to say welcome to Eno site the default page should say something like uh, default apache 2 uh, web page or something like that but that that one can be modified it's an html file and i can show you the default location of it the directory where the files are located for the web server it should be under cd to cover and it's going to be www forward slash html ls and this is the html file that serves that web page and inside here what you can do is you can place like a file that you want to download and then you should be able to access it so I already have a directory called downloads here we so we will do cd to download I have test file 7 and test file 1 which is a compressed file now let's see how to access this web server from a different computer you can access it from uh, another computer as long as you know the IP for this device we do IP address so this one is 172.16.1.103 I'm gonna open a browser on a Windows machine and see if we can access that 103 172.16.1.103 and we're getting that message on that site and we can do the downloads and we're able to see those files and we can click on the files to download them now if you are on a linux machine to download a file you need to do a, you can use wget command uh, let's see what what that will look like i'll open another machine here so i'm on a ubuntu linux machine and let's see how we can access those the directory like i said we'll use wget and then we'll use the http protocol for slash for slash we need the ip 172.16.1.103 we need to know the directory which was downloads uh, say downloads and then let's say we if we needed one of the files test, test file seven i believe we are able to pull the file here connected to that IP on port 80 and then we pull test file 7 for us so that's it for this video that's how you can turn your Linux Mint into a web server and not only be able to serve the web page or web pages you can also serve files that can be downloaded remotely 
So I hope this information has been helpful. I'll catch you in my next video. Thanks. Bye.